Drone crash at White House comes as FAA develops rules. The crash of a quadcopter drone on White House grounds early Monday comes as the Federal Aviation Administration is developing long-awaited rules for commercial unmanned aircraft. Congress ordered the FAA in 2012 to develop rules for commercial drones, which range from a few ounces to as big as an airliner, to share the skies with passenger aircraft by September. So far, Commercial drones are largely prohibited, although the FAA has granted 16 permits out of 295 applications for purposes such as movie making and smokestack inspections. USA Today Small drone found on White House grounds The agency's latest proposal for small commercial drones weighing up to 55 pounds, such as a real estate agent might use to film a property, is scheduled to be released by Friday. The FAA restated its rules for hobbyists in June, which include avoiding manned aircraft, flying within sight of the remote pilot, staying below 400 feet in the air and notifying air traffic control towers if flying within 5 miles of an airport. We want people who fly model aircraft for recreation to enjoy their hobby but to enjoy it safely, Transportation Secretary Anthony Fox said at the time. At DOT, we often say that safety is a shared responsibility, so to help, we are providing additional information today to make sure model aircraft operators know exactly what's expected of them.